In the waning days of 1991, the mighty Soviet Union dissolved, and with it came the decentralization of its massive nuclear arsenal. On December 25th of that pivotal year, about 35,000 nuclear weapons were scattered across the former Soviet landscape. While the bulk of these strategic weapons, including missiles, bombers, and submarines, were located in Russia, other former republics also held significant arsenals. Ukraine, for instance, found itself in possession of approximately 1,900 strategic nuclear warheads nestled within intercontinental ballistic missiles and bombers. Belarus held around 81 strategic nuclear warheads, mostly housed in missile form. Meanwhile, Kazakhstan contained a sizable collection of about 1,400 warheads in similar configurations. Despite their newfound custodianship, these republics were not in control of the warheads. The all-important launch and arming codes, known as permissive action links, remained with Moscow's central command. As such, Ukraine, Belarus, and Kazakhstan couldn't launch the warheads on their own, lacking the necessary electronic codes. Nevertheless, their possession of these weapons raised significant international security concerns about long-term control. The resolution to this precarious situation came in 1992 with the signing of the Lisbon Protocol, an extension of the Strategic Arms Reduction Treaty, start I. It was agreed by the newly independent states of Russia, Ukraine, Belarus, and Kazakhstan that nuclear weapons would be relinquished by all except Russia, who was recognized as the nuclear successor of the USSR. Through cooperation with the United States' Nunlugar Cooperative Threat Reduction Program, this transition was facilitated. This program allowed for the dismantlement or return of nuclear warheads to Russian territory. By 1996, Kazakhstan had transferred all its nuclear weapons back to Russia, and Belarus had relinquished its nuclear arsenal as well. By the time 1996 rolled into 1997, Ukraine also followed suit, returning all its nuclear weapons to Russia.